I recently uncovered what was probably the first flight simulator that I ever played, Chocks Away. If you ignore the original Elite, which I never really got into thanks to its limited 3D graphics and crashing into the mail slot when trying to dock a lot. Released in 1990 with the expansion missions pack in 1991, Shocks Away was designed to run on an Acorn A3010, or better, sporting a 32-bit single-core ARM CPU with a 1000 nanometer process at a whopping 12 MHz, or 0.012 GHz. With 2 MB of RAM and my personal favourite feature, green function keycaps. You might recognise the ARM CPU brand name as today they produce CPUs used by most tablets and mobile phones. Returning back to Chocks Away however, it captured my attention although it wasn't a particularly realistic simulation pitting a Tiger Moth biplane armed with a 30mm um, cannon versus German World War One aircraft. It did have reasonable flight physics for the time, limited fuel, damage and even, um, well, an aircraft carrier, or at least an approximation of one. You could also say this was my first carrier ops experience as well. And rather unusually for an Acorn computer, support for joysticks, if you can call them joysticks, with only digital inputs and an extremely limited selection of buttons. It also had split screen multiplayer, allowing you to fly the missions together with a friend, and even local network multiplayer if you had two Acorn computers hooked up together. So I thought it would be cool to give Chucks Away a revisit and play a little today. We'll be playing the Extra Missions expansion which features some improved graphics, AI and generally more complex scenes over the original base Chucks Away. Unfortunately I've not been able to get my original disc of the Extra Missions working on emulation, possibly due to copyright protection. So, we are running the demo disc for the Extra Missions expansion. Our mission today is to strike supply lines, specifically some cargo planes, a train, and aircraft control tower at the nearby airbase. So within the sim we've got our fuel gauge on the left, our airspeed indicator, then our altitude, and on our right we have our compass, and then to the far right we've got our health bar. The map. You can see flashing icons for our enemies, we've got to shoot down two transport planes and a terminal control tower. So we'll get ourselves started up. And up into the air. So we'll head out to the target. I was thinking we'll try and just hit the targets and then run out quickly. We've got uh, a nice bit of scenery going on. This is much more detailed than the kind of missions you'd see in the earlier in the original release maps, which would be much more sparse with objects. And we've got a rugby pitch, and we've got looks like a fighter or some sort of triplane over here. And he's shooting at me. Nope, not going to get a chance on that. Bring it around. Alright, so he's running away again. The trouble is these guys can be a bit of a pain and it's quite difficult to hit them with such slow bullets. Alright, so I've not had any luck catching that guy. We're going to try and get towards the target and just keep an eye on him. You can see our objective just there. And over here roughly should be the cargo planes if we keep on flying up. And is that that's shooting at me? I think that might be a train. Bring it around. Yeah that looks like a train. He's got flat coming up at me so let's give him a gun. Don't think we got him, sadly. No, he's still up. And very much upset with me. Turn it round, let's have another go. 
try and dive in on him. It would help here if I had some rudder control, but I don't. Took a hit. I don't know if we actually hit him there. I'm spraying a bit wildly. So I'll try playing again. He's not bothering us at the moment. And there's a flak. Right back onto our train. See if we can catch him on the crossroads. And yeah, there we go. One train destroyed. And there goes a the triplane again. It's a damn difficult job catching these triplanes because they're very maneuverable and our bullets are all very slow. And there's a second one apparently. Where is he? There. Yeah, there we go. I had this three of them even. Bring it round. That house still wants to have a gummy down below. Let's see if we can't hit that one. I don't know if we can. It's not like we killed it. We took another hit, I think, from the fighters whilst we were doing that, so that was a bit reckless, really. Bring it round, see if we can get a deflection. No, the bullets are too slow. And I guess the lead, which is quite difficult, being hit again and again. And, uh, and we're dead. Alright, uh, let's give it another go, I guess. Alright, so we're back in. I'm heading back toward the train first this time round. We've got Flak already coming about us. There's a fighter up ahead. He hasn't bothered us just yet, but he probably will soon. Flak's getting a little close. There's the second triplane. Just gonna keep an eye on them, see if they come my way. That one's taking an interest, but no good. And we got someone on our tail. Brilliant, okay. Try and manoeuvre, get him off him. There we go. Bring it up and over, see if we can't catch him. And I've lost him, I guess. Alright, let's go for the train since it's right in front of us. We'll leave the target a bit more this time. Hopefully this will be enough. These guns are getting awful close. And... Oh, we're hit, we're hit. Yep, we've got the train as well. Alright, so there's a another plane behind us. On the triplanes. We'll try the external camera, it gives you a wider field of view, although it's a little harder to see where you're actually going. Looks like we lost him. Oh, there's more bullets going past us. Spin it round. Try and stay away from that house. Can we get a shot on this guy? Not looking likely. I don't really know which way he's heading and he's quite far off to be honest. Just spraying and hoping for the best. Thankfully you have got unlimited... No, he's turned around. You have got unlimited ammunition, but... Uh, bullets you have are very slow. So I come round, this guy shouldn't be too hard to catch, he's a lot less manoeuvrable than the others, so just lead him. Just keep on leading and guess how much, there we go, we've got the hit. So he should be going down now. Off he goes. we got our airbase just ahead of us, and yeah, there's still triplanes tri right on our tail. It's spinning to be a hard target. But the twin's gone down. See if we can't push to the airbase and get our target, but those fighters don't want to leave us alone. Come on. 
Oh, hang on, we got the. Uh, that looks like the transport planes. Let's get those quickly. Turn in and shoot them up. <laughs> this, these guys are absolutely massive. Look at the size of them. Is there some way to finish this guy? Did we get him? No, he's still alive. You see the other go down. That's a massive explosion. Nice. Bring it around. Let's see if we can finish off our other transport plane before he gets down to land. Shouldn't be too difficult. Just spray him down with bullets. There we go. He's going down. And kaboom. So that's the two cargo planes. Let's see if we can sneak in now and get that. This isn't looking so good actually. Get that tower. If we just. Yeah, I'll just abandon that run. If we had a rudder, I might have been able to just squeeze it in, but well, there's a lot of flak. Oh, and now we got the fighter, he's got some big teeth on him too. I didn't think those guys had guns, given they got uh, multiple engines. I didn't expect a forward firing gun. Let's turn it around and see if we can catch one of them. They're dancing with far too many aircraft at once right now. Any of those? No. And just guess the lead. It's much more like a fire hose than a than a machine gun. Ah, no. <laughs> Got fighters just absolutely everywhere after us. All right, I'm gonna leave him be because I can't catch him. I'm gonna shoot up the tower since it doesn't move. Just hope the flak doesn't catch us. And there we go. That's all the objectives complete. Now. <laughs> Now we just need to stay alive and get home. So which is all the way off to our east in that direction. Hopefully we can extend. Just get away from the airbase for a start. So we don't have to fight the fighters and the flak at the same time. Looks like they're giving us some space and the ground's coming up a bit faster to pull up. Flack on our left again. This one of those uh gun houses. Oh hang on. That's a fighter. Yeah, that's a an iron decker. Rather nicely all the aircraft have their own kind of colour schemes, so you can tell them apart even if you can't see the detail on them. That twin doesn't look like he's gonna be too hard of a target, so let's see if we can get in quickly. Before one of the other fighters comes in and shoots at us. Right, that's not gonna not gonna give us a chance from it, so we've got to get out of here. Spin it round again. Bit of a uh, a fighting retreat going on here. I don't think I'll be able to shoot these all of these guys down. Be better off just trying to get back to the airbase. Another flak house. Let's see if we can't catch this one. I'm starting to think new. No. We'll give up on that, we're gonna head back, I think. So we'll pick up a bit of speed, just dive down toward the deck, keep the airspeed up so hopefully they can't keep with us and we can get some distance and extend. No, he's not gonna let us, he's gonna just maneuver. He's going to keep shooting at us. Let's try not to hit the church. Maybe we can get one of them to hit it as we go by. Another flat gun. Everything wants to kill me. <laughs> yeah, okay, there's two triplanes right on my tail. Yeah, that was never going to hit anything. Let's see if we can't pull some lead. Have one hit, one hit. Let's finish him off. Come on, there we go. So we caught a triplane at last. They are a nightmare to catch. They're so manoeuvrable, and they often won't present a good target. They'll just kind of fly away from you in circles. All right, where are we? catch 
position quickly. Um, I don't think we'll keep manoeuvring for that flat beneath us so he doesn't hit us. But it might have hit us just then, in fact. That's not working out. We'll turn back. Carry on fighting our retreat toward the airbase. Just keep on pushing east. Well, we've been given a respite. There's a guy running parallel on my left, but no one has a direct threat right now. And that's our airbase just ahead of us. Let's see if we can get in there quickly and escape them. Looks like they're going to give us the breathing room, so I'll slow down, cut the power. And ease it in. Line up. And touch down. So we've killed all our targets, plus the train, and as you can see, they are not messing around with the difficulty on this. That was quite a tough fight in and out, and I left enemy aircraft out there alive, who of course all got to fly home. If you've enjoyed this look back into my past of flight sims, you might also be interested in my Fleet Defender F-14 videos, or my retro videos playlist on the channel. I hope you enjoyed, and take care.